Hi, welcome to what's well, probably going to be the first video on my second channel, which will be behind the scenes stuff and personal stuff rather than the workbench techie stuff. Um, what I'm going to be looking at today is the Behringer Q802 USB and a specific issue with it. Um, various people have found this online is by default it appears as a mono device although it is a two channel usb sampling device it appears as mono so i'm going to just quickly go through how you change it in windows 10 from being a single channel device to a stereo device so let's start off by demonstrating the problem i guess now I've got this set up with two condenser microphones. All the channels are set the same apart from pan. I've got one on left, one on right, and if I tap the microphones, you can see that the corresponding channel over here flickers. Now, if I just jump over to my desktop, I'm sorry, this is where the audio is going to get a bit nasty. Now, I've got two different audio devices recording at the same time, but you can see just here, this is the 802 input. And if I tap this side, if you watch on the left hand side of the monitor. You can see that when I tap one microphone, we get the sound to the video and the view meter in OBS leaps up and down a bit. And when I tap the other microphone, we just get the sound that was picked up by the first microphone. So the desk is behaving like a mono desk. It's coming into Windows as a single channel device. So how do we fix it? It's a little bit awkward. Now, if we go over to bottom of the screen here, right click on the sound icon, open sound settings. Now, I found it sometimes works better if you do not have the 802 selected here. But well, ignore everything there and go to sound control panel. Tap on that and then you go into the recording tab. Here we have the USB audio codec device is what it appears as. Uh, I've named my microphone 802. You go into here and properties and then go up to advanced properties and by default it's a one channel device 16 bit 44k so just drop that down go down to two channel 16 bit 48 kilohertz okay now i've got obs running at the moment so it's going to say the device is in use that's fine I'll mute the device, say OK to that, then back in OBS, and we can now see down here we've got stereo channels, I'll mute it, now if you're listening with headphones We're in stereo. If we watch on the, uh, the displays just here, left and right channels, 
now working as they should. So it's a bit of a pain in the bum. Uh, if you use the standard Windows 10 dialogues to get there, it doesn't actually let you change the settings because the test my microphone bit of the form seems to stop you changing the settings because the microphone's in use. But if you just go in through the settings control panel, uh, sorry, sounds control panel, you can get the settings. You can set it to two channel, 16 bit, 48K. And then you get stereo input off the 802 USB. Hope that helps. Um, when I was looking for this solution, I couldn't find it on YouTube, so I thought I'd make a video of it. See you again.